My friends, welcome back to this Stellaris guide. Now, last time we had a bit of a peace deal going. Well, even though we had, didn't have that many options, um, we separated that, uh, that uh, terrain and they are immediately fighting again uh, with someone else. So, let me turn off my phone for a second because it was um, zooming. Mm, the plasma thrower is kind of nice, it does more hull damage. Accuracy 80, fracking is 40, tracking is 40 actually, and uh, the range is 40 as well. This in combination with the other one is kind of nice. Mm. But getting the physics at this point. Capacity overload, looking at our influence, let's do, let's get this edict. Because it will give us plus 20 in, um, in energy, and I want to have the other one as well that does the minerals, so that's going to be quite... Uh, lovely. Who are, who are you? Did you separate yourself? Wow, these guys, they have not been sitting still. They are making way too many enemies for this point in the game. Now, we still have a lot of things to do because look at this. Fleet power is already overwhelming. So that's not a good sign because they want to have their stuff back. And I can't blame them. Okay, let's increase the amount of energy. We want to increase the amount of alloys even more. Alloys are going to be quite useful and quite important. So there's a lot of things that we need to be doing. We definitely want to get more armies. We don't want to make armies over here because we will lose them. We got the cold fusion reactor. Um, because of our science ship over here. So that's great, meaning that we all have to upgrade these ships again. 130, not so much, but it will do a tiny, tiny amount. Because uh, you know that with overpower, uh, you'll have more speed. You'll have, well, a lot. We have a new thing discovered, huh? Great. Where? Is it this one? Yeah, we're excavating that one. So maybe we can actually use this planet eventually. Borders have been closed. Debris has been analyzed. It's been great. This science ship is now not doing anything. And it can't do anything. So let's send you... Over here. And assisting in the research is going to be your task. Ships, refitted. Uh, ships are being refitted. One of 2.4k. We definitely want to make sure that before this war is going to kick off again, we have resupplied the entire fleet, refitted the fleet. Uh, anchoring is being made because we need a lot more anchoring crew quarters. So we definitely would like to have a fleet over here once the peace deal is almost done. The truce will end in seven years. Hmm. You know what? Let's get rid of you. We don't need you no more. We can't repair you. We don't have to upgrade you, which is quite nice. We do did have to do that in, uh, in Star Trek New Horizons. Let's see, Bastion. And we look at this. We can now see their ships. And uh, we can see that they are definitely, that then they're not weak, but we don't have to see them as that overwhelming. There's definitely a fleet somewhere else, but if we can bait them, let's take a quick look at their ships. So they're having tech free UV lasers, that does more against armor, and they're focusing more on shield damage because they have this tech free. How about your destroyers? They're no are they hives? Are they using like brickets? Are you using anti-missiles? And look, there is a sickening amount being created here. I don't like it at all. I'll be very honest about that. But they're still that that the technology is what's going to be a problem for them. Especially now that they are being well, kind of having the short end of the stick. So we're not having, we don't have to be too worried about everything yet. 
So let's uh, let's save up here. So we are zero on energy credits. We do want to get more minerals. The birth of the galactic market. Oh great, great. Can we get like slaves already? We can't. Oh, it's fine. Let's buy more alloys. And make sure that we do our best to get our strike force up and running again. Yeah, this war is, is, is happening. So we want to make sure that we have armies and they will come in from this end. So this is, is going to be an extremely important station. Uh, we got the high traders. Also, we should be investing some minerals in the artisan troop to boost the happiness of our planets construction has been complete can we get a a listening post up there they're actually pushing in them i might might just can we give them open borders we have forced open borders i would actually like to give them open borders so they could deal with this this is relatively dangerous. Although they are superior. Let's see. So we got some ships over here from them. What are you using? Point defense. Oh, that makes sense. That you are losing this fight. How about you? You are ready to upgrade. Still point defense, huh? Shield wise level 3. That is quite nice. It's really nice. Construction complete. All of this is being built up. You don't want you don't anything over here. Yeah. This one. We're going to be changing this one back to the anchoring. I'm actually considering. No, we're going to keep this as a bastion because I'm sure they will be heading all of their fleet in here. Now, there's going to be a problem for them with this war. <laughs> and it's going to be a problem for us in the future. Because eventually their fleets will not be able to enter. Let us end rivalry. And we could probably open our borders then. At least until that war finishes. And I would rather be dealing with the... Uh, well, actually, no. The hives are so much more dangerous. Because of the more population they have. And they have a sickening amount of 123. And, and it's just a bit less because we definitely did a bit of a damage towards them. But we need to make sure that we do a lot more damage. So. We need armies. Let's build three overall. Not over here because that is where the... Um, it's this one. So let's not build armies over here. I did do that last episode. I'm an idiot. I'm sorry for that. They were instantly destroyed. Transport fleet. I'm going to keep you... With these guys. Again. Uh, we got okay. Let's let's do a pick here. Starbase capacity by two, an army damage plus twenty. Ship building cost and building speed. Ship firing rate increases by ten, and that is quite nice. Starbase damage plus twenty. Fleet command limit plus twenty. Admiral leveling cap. Ship upkeep, naval cap by 20. I'm thinking heading over into Supremacy. And then head over to these others. So let's go into Supremacy. Um, we'll get more of that. Uh, it is, it's all fine, but we want to get naval cap. We want firing. We want everything. Let's increase. Because these guys are definitely going to be uh, something else. A friendly and superior. We have a lot of trade deals with them. We could declare them rivals. They would no longer be very friendly. How about you guys? Well, you're still gaining 
That is good. Especially now. We're, we're not there yet. Uh, once the border closes with these guys, it, this is going to be funny. Because they will... Oh, they're at war with more as well. Construction complete. Oh. I'm kind of hoping they will get this done. Oh boy, look at this. Yeah, you don't like me, I don't care about that. Your super equivalent superior. There you go, we're almost there. We're almost at the point where our fleets are strong enough to deal with the others. Uh, the hives is still a problem, look at that. Superior, superior, superior. Just let it, let it do whatever. Are there enemy fleets nearby? Well, no, they are really struggling. There is an open building slot. Let's see. This will do... This actually is not too bad. Commercial zone. Five cleric jobs. That's sick. That is just sick. I love it. Especially the trade value is quite strong. And we are on 1k and I can't spend it on. Well, we could start claiming. We could claim some uh, territory from this fella. But it is uh, going to be somewhat expensive. I don't see the need to do this right away. The, I, I don't need to trigger anyone. Okay, we need a green guy. You busy commanding no longer. A genius. Ooh, definitely want to level you up. Let's keep on boosting our fleet. In terms of economy, I would say we're pretty weak. But, oh my, this, this is quite nice. It is kind of hazardous, but energy credits from jobs plus 20. There is nothing else this could be... Then a generator world. But we're going to be starting once again with a colony. Put it on for automatic up upgrades. We need to create a sector because it was too far away. Meaning we are going to be needing another leader. Uh, and they're all... Sh well, not so good. But we definitely want to be increasing the energy production over there. The energy planets. Really nice. Let's merge you all together. Let's go to the fastest speed. So definitely amenities. And look at this, the stability. Horrible. So make, make that building. Make the commercial zone. Any more amenity problems? Uh, event is pendling... Continue the search. Let's close that. Amenities over here, but we can't change anything. I kind of would like the building over here as well. So let's do that. Mapping the stars. Well, there's no point in spending it at the moment. Maybe we could spend it with the artisan trip. Hmm. No, we need energy. Uh, here we go. Capacity overload. Not a minute too late. Let's go to Edict. Let's go Capacity Overload. And that will immediately change, I believe, with the next tick. So it's going to be soonish. Um, I kind of feel the need to go for more energy. And focus a tiny bit on uh, on our economy. Uh, this will change due to the um, to the edict. So it's negative seven. Now it's plus thirty. Definitely how we want it. Okay, we need to start saving up for star holds. Let's call them alien scum. 
These guys are still just going left, right and center inside of my borders. How long until it's closed? Human absorption wall. They look funny though. Kind of like that. Borders have been closed. With this um, Mega Corp. Well, at least a Mega Corp logo. So let's get rid of that. This is building up slowly. You are doing research. Wow, look at that. They are just so busy. We are really need to fortify this one. We might even have to go and, and do like a defensive pack. I kind of do like the migration treaty. Let's take a quick look of if things have changed. No, they didn't. Well, okay. I can understand that. They are other species, though. Construction complete. Construction That's complete. me. That is all done. Trade value will go up. Cleric jobs will go up. There you go, colony. We want to get more minerals. Uh, you need an empty building as well. Let's go with the gene clinic. Once this is higher off, we're definitely going to be focusing a lot more on the alloys. Atomic countdown. For the past 42 years and 3 days, research... researchers on Unity have eagerly anticipated the countdown of the mysterious atomic clock. And found on this planet oh okay that's going to be disappearing now several decades worth of heat um, speculation and conjecture have evaporated for an instant among most of this planet so it is now a toxic world and we can't be doing anything with it uh, planetary capital which is great population growth speed it's kind of what I would like to get right now. So let's do that. And the reason for it is um, we need to get more slots open. And by doing that we need more population. And by getting population, yeah, you'll get it, right? So let's get more minerals. As soon as we can. Closed borders again. Let's build you. Uh, the birth of space pirates. The mega church. So that will change. Minerals are going up. Energy is going up. And look at the size of these guys. Just status quo them. Do whatever. But we need to get these guys out of the game. They're really tearing in them a new one. Very interesting. Don't trust you at all. How is my superior? So they're no longer overwhelming, which is fine. We got a defensive pack invitation and I'm... I kind of feel like we need to take it. Let's accept. For now. But this could mean that... The, well, it is only in effect when your ally is declared on... Migration treaty has been broken. Yeah, we're, we're on a... Um, yeah, they don't like it. Because they are rivaling the other. So, we mean... We, we can actually start using our influence then. Let's go and do some claiming. All the way to Vega. Yeah, this, this would be fine. For now. We don't want to go overboard. And they will definitely not like the fact that we claimed on them. So most likely on the next tick, these guys are going to be not so friendly with us. Yeah, there you go. Our, uh, our claims on them, negative 40. They're on plus 27. So we're starting to break relations with other alien empires. And still building up our fleet. Research deal has been broken. That makes a lot of sense. 
So how is that fleet looking like? Yeah, just just pure on everything, but they are kind of weak on armor, heavy on shields. Maybe let's take a look at our designs. So we're heavy on shields. That's great. That's what I want to see. The destroyer in, uh, are also heavy on shields. Let's let's flip. Now, nah, actually, flipping just makes no bloody sense. You are lacking housing. Let's do that. Hacking housing. Someone died. Oh, great. Someone died again. Another scientist is biting the dust. Uh, let's get you then. Doesn't matter. We have that, um, that genius still. Colony is missing work. Okay, that's great. That's what I want. Okay, let's uh, sell. Sell some stuff. Wait, we don't have that anymore? Oh, there you go. Um... Selling that for minerals. And just get energy done. Let's make two of them for now. That's going to help our energy production quite soon. As you can see this, we're now on plus three. Don't forget, we still have that one edict going. Uh, won't be long until uh, this peace treaty is going to be broken. Yeah, next year. We'll, we'll have to prepare for this. We'll have to prepare. We have to be prepared. Let's start building up. We're now on 4k. They're superior. Um, most likely we'll, we'll start our defense over here at this station. Which is fortified. We also want to make sure we start upgrading the star holds. We need so much more alloys. You don't have a building. You don't have building slots. You don't have building slots. On screen, go to red alert. Okay, let's deal with these guys over there. Before they get too annoying. The birth of space pirates. So that has something to do with our trade lines just being raided too much. Now you could send of course your fleet to go on an anti-pirating mission. Like over here, patrolling. And just see where the pirate levels are just too high. I think actually by taking this these guys down, it, it's, it's going to be more than enough. There's a peace offering. We have a trade deal coming in. Energy. Oh, thank you. Thank you for your energy. I like that. So, let's put that energy to good use. Buy more. And get more ships. And uh, return home. Rivalry has been declared against us. Fleet command status, peace offerings not too interesting and that rivalry job ain't too interesting either. Uh, we got a new breakthrough here. Oh, there we go. Upgrading the... Oh! Ooh, this would be so nice. But, we would need a volatile mode. Unfortunately, we are not ready to deal with that. What I do would like to get is this. These space torpedoes. They do the whopping damage against shields and armor. They're so nice to have especially on larger ships so let's do those torpedoes you are lacking housing and amenities let's build a district but we need to be preparing for this one it won't be long until they are being pushed out of the borders again let's see where these uh, the biggest fleets are and they are currently just fighting in this region this would be the very first shipyard, or actually uh, station that I would upgrade. 
and go full bastion most likely just so the ships from this end just can't find their way up here and we're going to be taking the, their planets and they will just well well we could leave them this one they'll uh, be absorbed by the neighbors but i want to get nimbus nimbus is my next target because it has a planet that we could use as for now thank you all for watching i do hope you find this useful and i'll see you next time have a good one bye bye